All right, welcome back to Vengeance Story. So it's been a bit of time since I was uh, last making a video. Uh, and in between that time, I did some playing off camera as well as a couple of test live streams that I wasn't really happy with the quality of, but regardless, we've made some progress. So the first thing you probably notice is that we have copper tools now. Uh, in one of the early test live streams, I managed to find a lot of copper and we have since made all the necessary molds and turned them into our first set of metal tools. Um, we've also expanded our storage somewhat and added a floor where we're currently sleeping. It is a dirt floor, but it is what it is. Uh, our other uh, item of improvement, and let me go ahead and grab my uh, nice new metal tools. Let's go ahead and grab our ax. Our other thing, which you may be able to see over here on the mini-map, is we have a garden now. Let's see. So what I did was, is I kind of isolated this uh, little peninsula here a bit and put some fence around it. But as you can see, we have our first set of crops growing. We have a decent chunk of spelt. We have some flax, some onions, and some uh, turnips. And those are all growing nicely now. Let's go ahead and water these while we're here. Just to make sure everyone's, you know, getting all the water that they need. Perfect, okay. So that's one major change. But now what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and gather the materials we need to um, to uh, to uh, fire uh, this additional storage vessel and these ingot molds. So let's go ahead and do that now. What we also need to do is we need to make... Need to make a flint knife. We also need to make a lot more charcoal. What I'd also like to do today is go back to where we found this large deposit of copper and see if we can find some actual ore in the ground. There are the knives that we need. And what I'm also going to do is I'm going to make us a decent number of torches since we're going to probably be going, we're going to be going underground today. Or that is the hope at least. So let's go ahead and get all of this made into torches. Let's deposit this. Um, let's go ahead and plant these pines. Oh dear, we seem to be starving. All right, let's see what we can do about that problem. I don't like having to do this, but it is what it is. And what we'll also do is um, go ahead and start a second fire here so we can get some of these cattails cooking. Let's go ahead and place these in their pit kilns. Oh, and there's our anvil molds. Now, I don't want all of these to be turned into food, so we'll keep 12 of them to replant. 
with the garden. So let's go ahead and do that. And then we're going to go ahead and cut down some trees, get some sticks and some more fibers. So I'm just going to Eventually, those will be some more cattails for us to continue to get plant fiber from. Now let's go ahead and get some trees. I'm going to try and head away from the area that I know has uh, wolves, because those are not fun to deal with. It looks like there's a wolf out there. Fun. So we're using a pit kiln on two things, so we're going to need 16 sticks at least. And I'd like a little more leftover for other things. All right, uh, let's keep this tree because it has resin. Actually, some multiple of these trees do, so let's go ahead and mark that on the map. Some resin here, I use orange for resin. Nice. And I'm kind of curious to see how, um, how powerful is this? Does this have, okay. See how fast this is. Definitely feels faster. He's up. Does this have no it doesn't. Oh, it does have resin. How do I extract resin? I don't think I've actually done this before. There we go, we got some resin. So what we can probably do is we can probably think about getting a bow soon. All right, perfect. Let's head back home and get the pit kilns going. Okay, all right. First things first. Oop, I did not light that. That's silly me. All right, let's grab some. Firewood. This one lit. And we're going to need a couple more for this one. 
Let's go ahead and bring this inside as well. Eventually we can cast our um cast our anvil when we have the proper amount of copper. Perfect, okay. Alright, so while we're in here, let's go ahead and make some more firewood. And what I'd also like to do is to go ahead and fill up the pit kiln that we have going over here, where we're going to be making some more... Um, Firewood, or charcoal, I should say. Going to have to run away soon. Let's go ahead and get back indoors where we belong at night. And get our door back on. And let's get some food. Okay. Let's go ahead and deposit that here. Put these two things back. Um, and let's go ahead and put this back. We'll just throw that somewhere for now. Okay, let's go ahead and sleep. And the next day we're going to continue gathering up some more wood to finish off that Get kiln for charcoal, and we're going to get some more food. Alright, the sun is rising. Some more of this. Okay, all right, let's get some more firewood. But actually, first things first, we can go ahead and use some of that charcoal to keep cooking. Let's do this. Got some good torches now, all right. Let's go ahead and get some more firewood. And we're going to actually go over to where we've been finding copper and see if we can locate anything. And what I'm going to do while I'm here right quick is I'm going to I'm gonna make another spear because this one's about to break. Or do I have... I don't have a spare spear laying around, unfortunately. So let's go ahead and make one, just to have some additional defense. Perfect. Okay. Grab a stick here. All right, got another spear to our name. Let's go ahead and deposit the charcoal, uh, and I think we're only going to need one knife where we are. So let's go ahead and just hang this one up, um, and let's grab our shovel. Right, and let's go do some mining. Those two are still going. Okay, perfect. Let's head off to where we found all that copper. It's going to be 
right over here. So let's go ahead and pin that. And we're also going to be on the lookout for any um, any food or any any predators as well. Because the last thing we want to do right now is die with all this nice gear on us. Oh, and another thing that we also found last time is we found a uh, trader that is willing to buy glass. So that could be a potential uh, source of gears, which is basically the game's uh, currency for trading. So that could be a way for us to get it. Now, I found a lot of copper in this area right here. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a peek into... Uh, To this cave and it actually looks like that's stone brick so is there a ruin down there let's see that's what i thought yeah it does look like there's actually a ruin down there so let's go ahead and make ourselves a stairway There is definitely going to be one of those creatures down there. I can hear it. And I'm going to go ahead and dig at these just so there's not anything left above us and collapse for now. Let's be standing on stone when we do this. I'm going to dig down here. Still kind of getting used to the uh, graphics physics here. Or the, um, what does that mean? The gravity physics. Have our... Here's some kind of buzzing noise. Okay, we clearly have something here. Okay, we have a cave. some kind let's uh let's see what we got some kind of dungeon even i mean i kind of knew that there was something like this in the game i just didn't know uh that there was other things Okay. What's this? Jailer's hat. Oh, nice. We have some some rusty gears. Some old planks here. All 
right, now I don't... Okay, let's, let's be careful here and see what else is in here. I had no idea that this kind of thing could be in the game. It's pretty cool. Oh, cool. Okay. Well, we can put this on. And we got a bunch of these. Eat brick. You know, we can f we can always find more flint, but I'm gonna try and... Hey, nice, we have a table. I'm gonna take a table. Um... Ooh, more flint. What is this? Sandstone stone. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna take two of these tables. Okay. Oh, cool. is that uh is that all? Is there is there more? Cool. Okay. Well man, we already we already got a full inventory here. Um Okay. Well, let's head back to the surface. Um, and what we'll do actually is we're gonna go to that crater immediately, and we're gonna trade some of this uh, those wooden crate. Well, we'll see if that trade is an option. Okay, so unfortunately they're not willing to sell. Well, we'll find out. Nope, unfortunately not. Okay, well, um, are we able to actually use these crates for storage? I don't actually know. Um, Run back over here to our mining area. I guess we can't, but I guess what we can do is we can put it down there for now. Um, it's kind of irritating, actually. Um, tell you what, let's we gotta head home anyway because we're gonna die. Starvation. Oh, we just burnt out our torches. That was dumb. Okay, well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get home here and take care of the uh, hunger situation. And when we come back, we'll continue to... Uh, investigate that area for any more caves and of course the door falls off and with that i will see y'all later